61A, lecture number 33, announcements. There will be a gorilla section tomorrow, starting at noon, in the Soda Hall Labs. The scheme project is due next Wednesday. Earn an early submission bonus point by finishing on Tuesday. Homework 10 will be posted tonight. It's due next Thursday. And if that's not enough, I'm announcing the optional Scheme Recursive Art Contest. In this contest, you use your Scheme Interpreter to create art within the Scheme project. There is a file called Scheme Built-ins, and this allows you to use the Turtle module to draw. Python's Turtle module lets you draw fun stuff like this star. Within Scheme, you'll find several different built-in procedures that let you draw lines and curves. Look for turtle graphics in the Scheme built-ins file to see how to go forward and backward, left and right, and draw a line as you go. Or draw a circle, move the turtle, pick your pen up, put it back down, etc. Each of these is described briefly here and in more detail in the turtle module page of the Python documentation. You can also pick different colors, fill in shapes, and draw individual pixels. If these drawing primitives aren't enough, you're welcome to add your own. The Scheme Recursive Art Contest has been part of this course ever since I began teaching it. A winner from fall 2012, one from fall 2013. This one used a technique called ray tracing which I talked about in the Extra Lecture series. You can find videos of the Extra Lecture series lectures on the Extra Lecture page. There's that ray tracing video. After a few years of people drawing abstract shapes, students discovered that they could encode photographs and use them as part of their recursive art. In fall 2016, the winners reverted back to abstract shapes. And then in fall 2017, there was a surprise entry. I'll tell you that you can create a piece of art and you can give it a title. And you can also write a haiku or short poem describing your entry. And the way the contest is judged is by popular vote. Whatever the students like best, that's the winner of the Scheme Recursive Art Contest. In fall 2017, the winner used only seven scheme tokens to create the following art. And the next semester, there were many more circles, but the circles didn't win. Instead, the winner of the spring 2018 recursive art contest was a wonderful display of multiple abstract shapes. And here we are in fall 2018. You can enter anything you want. There are only a few guidelines. If you're not sure whether your entry meets the guidelines, you're welcome to ask. I look forward to what you come up with. You don't have to participate in the Scheme Recursive Art Contest, but it's really my favorite part of the course. So I hope you decide to enter. And submissions will be due on the Tuesday after Thanksgiving at 11.59 p.m.